Here's a GRE data question. Let's take a look. If S is a speed in miles per hour at which the energy used per meter during running is twice the energy used per meter during walking, then according to the graph above, S is between what and what? Okay, so what's most important on data analysis is that you understand the graphs that they're giving you. And to do that, you need to read the axes here, right? So the x-axis is the speed that we go in miles per hour, and the y-axis is the energy we use at that speed. And we have two cases, running and walking. So for instance, at two miles an hour for right there, I'm, I'm burning about 140 joules per meter when I'm walking, that's 140, and at two miles an hour when I'm running, I'm burning about 310 joules per meter. So what this, this question wants to know is at what point, at what speed, is the black line, the bold line, the running line, two times larger than the thin line, right? Clearly they're the same here, so it must happen at some point between here and here. Well, let's start at the very beginning. Uh, at, this, at this point, at a speed of two, we are more than twice, we're using more than twice as much energy, right? 310 is more than two times 140. But if we go over here to three, right? When I'm walking, I'm using, what is that? 150. And when I'm running, I'm using about 290. Well, that's less than two times as much. So if I was using more than two times as much at time two, and less than two times as much at time three, somewhere in here, I must have crossed that threshold, right? So that means that uh, it occurred somewhere between two and three, but that's not an option. So it has to be between 2.5 and 3.0. Correct answer here is A. For more GRE tips and tricks, or to sign up for my online course, follow the link on my profile.